So I am in the kitchen chowing down on a pork belly. I've never made one. Bought it at Aldi. Thought it looked like bacon. I was like, okay. Don't taste nothing like bacon. I scored the top. Put some salt. Duh. Um, some body of saison and some onion powder that's it threw it in the um, cast iron skillet upside down in the on the fat and uh, charred it flipped it put it in the oven 375 for like an hour and a half it's Oh my god i cooked it till it got to 165 plus something um it is moist it is juicy i ain't never made that before it's so good anyway i am on day mm -hmm, 106 of my carnivore diet yes i've had a couple of missteps over the last week Forgive me, it's been after 100 days, and but they've been on lessons. Hmm. Lesson number one, I had cheesecake Saturday night. My body said, hmm, hmm, hmm. Acted like all was well. Felt great till 2 in the morning. Woke me up out of a dead sleep with stabbing pain in my right belly. I thought I was going to die. And it would come and go and come and go and nothing I could did helped. <sighs> I did everything. I thought I was going to have to go to the hospital. I thought it was a blockage. Fast forward. Friend brings me something I haven't had in forever, but I was willing to do anything. She gave me some Pepto-Bismol. I took a tablespoon of that, and it was already on the verge of going away. Like, I had actually closed my eyes a little bit before she got there. Um, but I took it, and then I was out for two hours, and then the pain never came back. But I still ain't been right all week, and I've been up four pounds this week. Now, I did have some baked beans yesterday with my sunnies. I'm experimenting because, you know, I'm going to be going to um, another country this next month and I don't want to have a painful problem while I'm gone. So this month I've decided that I'm going to be introducing foods to see what is okay but still eating majority of my foods, carnivore. I'm still not going to be drinking. Um, yeah, I, I, that's done. That, 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 I don't see the benefit of that anymore, ever, for any reason, ever. Um, but anyway, yeah, that's how I'm doing. And uh, day 106, carnivore adventure. If you want to get started with this, go back and check out my videos. I've got all the way from day one to today. Um, yeah, and I got a lot of where I got my information, where I learned it from, and why I decided to try it. I didn't just make it up on my own. I followed some very influential, very positive gentlemen that have incorporated this into their life and subsequently into their practice and have helped their practices heal um, themselves because it's all you and what you put in here. It's a choice, y'all. And uh, yeah, it's not the easiest choice to stay on this 100%, but you don't get the results. Like I had that cheesecake, I'm up four pounds. No, actually I was like down to 128. And now it's 134 this morning. Just from a piece of cheesecake. What does that say that it does to my body? What did that flour 
I really think it was the flour and the sugar because I haven't had any due to every cell in my body if I'm up six pounds. That's crazy. So anyway, um, yeah. That and I added onions and cilantro Thursday, Tuesday. I had that Tuesday. And that gave me extreme gas, but it wasn't painful. And it didn't stink, just being honest. And, yeah. So, you know, that's where we're at. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm.